Now, when you look at the new India versus Bharat framing that the BJP is doing or the Chakte India framing that the opposition is doing, do you think any of this actually matters? Do you think this is just the BJP and the opposition having a little bit of rhetorical fun? Or do you think it actually matters? I think when battles start, they begin small. But I think in terms of branding, my many years of experience, both in political branding as well as in corporate branding, has taught me that there are basically four eyes as far as branding is concerned. And the division is 20% for impact, 30% for intent, 30% for the integrity of the brand, and 20% for the interplay effect. So if you look at the INDIA brand, the impact quotient is very high. I would say that what I call the mnemonicness of India is extremely high. So they score high. In terms of intent, we need to take what the Prime Minister is speaking about seriously and look as to and figure out do they have an intent beyond just trying to get together to be one opposition. In terms of integrity, what will they represent? What will people see them as is the question. And the last 20% which again I give them high marks on, is that in terms of interplay value, their brand has a very high interplay value because just as you said, the chief minister of Assam said Bharat and things, Mamta, within seconds of the name being announced, had already usurped the Bharat tag for this. So if you look at the millennial voter, if you look at the young voter, they see this brand as powerful. and that and there lies the rub. So to begin with, cheap shot, but great opening shot, and it works. Cheap shot, but great opening shot is an interesting uh, description. I want to take this to uh, Professor Ashwini Mahajan, but I'm, I'm told I'm not sure that he uh, he can actually hear us. Ashwini ji, can you, are you able to hear us? Yeah. Okay, great. Uh, okay. Ashwini ji, uh, let, me, let me ask you to respond to what Dilip Cherian has said. Cheap shot, but opening shot, acha hai. Uh, it's given the opposition a chance to say Chakte India. Uh, it's given the opposition a chance to say Bhai Ham Hai, Ham Hai India. Uh, you know, and, and it's it's given them a chance to actually take a little bit of the nationalism space that the BJP has often uh, owned politically at least. How would you respond, sir, to these alliance names? Uh, I uh, I don't agree with the, the late firm. Sorry, the late. Uh, the reason is... Uh, that uh, he himself has said that you know the kind of uh, uh, perception the people have got about them uh, most of them are family based uh, organizations and then uh, they don't have any common agenda except the fact that they are against a particular uh, party and a person and uh, therefore uh, this kind of uh, thing actually would benefit uh, the, the uh, NDA for the reason that uh, they already have built up a brand, brand Modi, and uh, uh, and that that will uh, that will in a way uh, nullify all these efforts uh, on the part of this, and the, you know uh, the very name India. And then uh, you see there are uh, there are several achievements of uh, the present government which uh, it will be very difficult for them to uh, really uh, counter. For instance, uh, a few days ago, a report has come from UNDP, and uh, this report says that unprecedentedly the uh, the poverty has come down. You see. These are the numbers which are given, which have been given by UNDP. That is one thing. On the ground, if you see, three crore houses built, eleven crore uh, toilets built, about ten crore Ujwala gas connections given, and several of such things. So, uh, about forty-five crore accounts open, direct benefit transfers, and a kind of Labharti, you know, the beneficiary approach of the present uh, 
dispensation has actually led to a brand uh, which it will be very difficult for the I think you I think you make a I think you make a very interesting point that the opposition is going up going up against an existing brand uh, uh, which is a very strong brand and also just to put that figure uh, the UNDP report that Professor Mahajan mentioned says that 415 million Indians came out of multi-dimensional poverty in the last 15 years so I just wanted to put that out in the public uh, domain a lot of the government's own programs also have the word India startup India for example how does the opposition co-op this phrase has it been too clever by half ye bhi ek cheez hoti hai ki aap itne clever ho jaye ki aap thode contrived na ho jaye 